Hi, my name is Pereira Olsen. In this short video I would like to show you a simple and free way to create your own welcome page to your fa Facebook fan page or business page like the one you see in front of you right now. And I will show you how to use a page called PageMoto. Uh, there are several companies out there uh, that you can use to create your own Facebook uh, welcome page, but PageMoto was the first one I worked with and uh, they have a lot of nice templates and you can get a free account uh, that uh, will help you to produce a good looking page. Actually the page you see right now can be done with a free account. So let's get started. Uh, I will connect with my Facebook account and immediately it will open and show me the pages that I have right now. And here, here you see the, the one I showed you before. I do have some other pages too. Uh, I will create a, a new page from scratch just to show you. Uh, go down to this part. Anyway, I have to choose what uh, business page or fan page I'm creating that new page for. So I will choose Pixism Team. That's a, just a test site that I have to, to show what can be done. And if you uh, look here, you will see uh, some examples of all the templates PageModa has prepared for you. You can actually click on all themes and you will see that they have a lot of them. So it should be possible for you to, to find a good looking one for your Facebook page. Um, they have some for uh, if you want to create your contact page, <coughs> sorry, uh, discount coupons, video content. Um, if you look at these, uh, you, you see it says Pro. So uh, if you plan to use a video, you need the paid account, one of the paid accounts for PageMoto. Uh, you have a bunch of simple templates, uh, different themed templates and uh, the most popular ones. So we're just uh, going to select the first one and uh, that is actually the one I have used for this welcome page. And uh, to start with uh, we can uh, select what color presets we would like to have for our page. Let's say we go for the red one and uh, we also have uh, configuration options. Um, as you see, this is a page with uh, two pictures and some text. Uh, if you want to have uh, more columns, more pictures, you can select that one. But uh, let's go for the simple one. <coughs> okay, so now we have decided what theme to use. We have set uh, theme options and uh, we can click next step. So this is where we add some content. That's really easy to do. Uh, it's just a matter of uh, clicking. You see we highlight the two different uh, parts of this template. Uh, let's say we go down to this part click that. What happens is that uh, we are requested to upload a picture. Um, I think I have a picture, picture that we can use that will fit to this page. It actually says uh, with 480 pixels for this one. And as you see you have uh, an option to, to crop your picture to, to make it look good. Um, here's a nice feature. Uh, you can actually add a link to your sales page or whatever you have, your website. So if anyone clicks on that picture they will go to 
in this example the travelsuccess.com you can also write some some hover text um, okay I think we stay with a picture like that uh, we can add a title um, let's say Pixism Travel and of course we can do a lot of things uh, we can make it bigger we can uh, change colors just by that let's say I want it red okay see you can immediately see what happens uh, you can center it uh, you can actually put a, a link uh, to the header itself if you want to to show another page okay let's stay with the header like that and down here you have some more information about your business or yourself uh, let's say we center that make it bold like that and leave the rest as it is so uh, the same thing for this part of course and uh, it was actually three parts so we can edit um, let's go for pixism up here too all over the world okay I think we we set um, wow well, we just take away that one okay if we decide that we are done with this picture just click done uh, so the next part we will come to is the live gate let's say I'm done editing and the like gate is uh, a thing you can use if you want to hide your content uh, for those who hasn't uh, clicked light on your page and uh, as you see you, you get some uh, suggestions uh, to this uh, want to see our page like us um, custom message or stay out sounds rude but uh, let's go for that okay so we're done easy as that uh, this is uh, where you can uh, publish your page of course you can uh, just leave it as it is and come back and, and do some more work with it later um, here you can see my, I actually have the pro account uh, where I can create seven pages and no uh, add page mode add on the footer uh, with a free account you can create one page um, what else uh, yeah let's uh, say what uh, we would like to call this one um, let's say we we just select the tab name of news I don't want to share that information right now I can share it to my personal profile or to my page of course I think that's it and um, just to publish Okay, it's done. It says your screenshot is being generated, but uh, even before that, we can go and have a look on Facebook to see how it looks. There we have it. Maybe it's not the most beautiful welcome pages I have seen, but uh, you can see how it, how easy it is to to do it and uh, when you're done just remember to to select that this 
news page will be the page where everyone uh, enters if they are not already a part of your like list. That's really important because you really want everyone to see your welcome page. I think that's it for now. If you have questions about this, uh, send me a message uh, Pererik at gate1marketing.com. Bye for now.